listen in the background there's some sirens I believe it's from fire yes yeah, from firefighters on the way to some emergency now yes you can still hear them are they posting here I'm not sure but anyway why am I talking about sirens um, firefighters first of all they were passing by so I thought I would use it as a parable for a video now I'm on my way home now so I'm just relaxing before I continue look when you hear a siren can be a siren of an ambulance of a police car or from a truck with firefighters you don't know you just know a siren's going off and it draws your attention you look around you to find out what is it now in life in life you will not know everything ahead of time you won't nevertheless there are echoes that will reach you ahead of time whether it's something good or something bad that's away for you now when it's something good that awaits you and you don't notice the symptom the symptom something good is coming that doesn't have to be a disaster because it's a good thing and there are many good things out there but if something bad that's on your way or it's something bad is nearby and you don't notice the symptoms well that's a that's an issue over there just like hearing sirens and not showing any interest in what's going on the sirens are designed to make that loud noise to catch your attention something's off that's why it sounds so loud and so annoying but if you hear sirens and you think man let me sleep man i don't want to hear about it or let me watch tv if that's your attitude it can be that the building you're in is on fire and you hear the sirens coming if you would have got off your lazy ass and went to the window you would have seen that whoa there are five fights over here and there are ambulances going on oh dear the building's on fire we need to get out of here but if you keep laying on your lazy behind watch tv or sleeping even though the sirens are alerting you to wake up and take some action well i don't saying you you won't survive it but it may will make you look bad and there will be some damage you have to live with if you rescued too late out of the fire even if you survive it there will be some bodily damage or whatever now again i'm using sirens as i'm not talking about the demonic entity sirens i'm using sirens here as a parable when your intuition goes off in an alarming way you always pay attention to it there are people when the intuition screams at them to slow down they don't slow down because they're so excited for I, I don't, whether it's for a job or a potential sex sex partner or uh, or some opportunity whatever they're so excited about something or someone that they don't don't they suppress the alarm that goes off inside of them there's something maybe off with the situation with the individual now it may not be a setup but there may be something associated with the individual or with the group of people or with the opportunity that you haven't considered yet your inner radar is always right now you don't know why your inner radar goes off just like when your sirens around you you don't know whether it's sirens from a police car or a truck or or an ambulance now maybe in some countries they sound different but even then when you're a siren you're not going to think oh is that an ambulance is that what no you just want to look what's going on so now that's how it should be well more alert you should be with your intuition never ignore it because if you do you will regret it some people never even got the chance to regret it because the situation was fatal for them was it for now hmm the signs are some alarming then but anyway keep on coming with christ and pay attention in the radar yeah peace